Hey guys, Gav from the service department here at Off Grid Outfitters. Today we're going to be talking about batteries. The two main types of batteries you'll come across in a camping or trailer setup are AGM or lithium batteries. Now we'll talk a little bit about the difference between AGM and lithium batteries. AGMs are more of your entry level battery. It's generally what you'll find in your camper trailer or caravan when you buy it directly off the showroom floor. AGM batteries operate the most efficiently between 150%. If you do run the battery down past 50%, it can result in you having to replace the battery because it might not regenerate all of its life. The main advantage of an AGM battery is it's a lot more cost effective than some of the other options on the market. The disadvantages though are it can only be discharged to 50% and they are a bit heavier than the other options on the market. Lithium batteries have been around in the camping and off-road industry for quite some time, but they're becoming more and more popular these days, and here's a couple of reasons why. Lithium batteries allow you to use up to 98% of their capacity. What that means if we're comparing AGM to lithium batteries is we'll make an example of two batteries at the same amp average of 200 amps an hour, one AGM and one lithium. If you take an AGM at 200 amps and drain it down to its 50%, you get 100 amp hours of usable power. If you do the same with the lithium, you can almost use up to the full 200 amp hours. So by having a lithium battery, you actually have more power stored that is usable. Because of the way a lithium battery is designed, if you do happen to run it flat, it doesn't actually damage the battery. Some of them will need to be jump started so they kind of wake up out of the sleep mode and do recharge. That will be by applying 12 volt power to the terminals. These days, some of the newer lithiums actually have a reset button inbuilt to the battery. So it's as simple as hooking it up to the charger, pressing that reset button, and it'll be back in action in no time at all. The pros of a lithium battery are they are lighter and you have more stored usable power. The cons are they are a bit more expensive than the other battery we're comparing it to today, being AGM. So a question we get asked here regularly is what can people do to make sure they get the most life out of their battery? The first step to that is to make sure that you keep the battery topped up at all times when the trailer's not being used. As some trailers are self-sufficient, they've got multiple solar panels mounted on the roof and that gives the trailer more than enough power on a sunny day to keep the batteries topped up. If that's not an option with your setup, we recommend plugging it into the wall, giving it 240 volt power. Some of our customers don't have the luxury of that either. And in that case, we recommend plugging a solar panel in and just giving that trailer a bit of a trickle charge and that'll keep your batteries topped up. It's always a great idea to regularly inspect your batteries. Some things to check would be that the terminals are tight, the battery is secured, there's no funny smells or liquid leaking and the battery isn't bulging. So if you're at the stage of choosing a battery to suit your setup, a couple of things to consider. Where you'll be traveling to, what appliances you'll be using, and is weight an issue in your setup. With these in mind, there'll be a battery out there to suit your requirements for any budget. If you're looking at getting an upgrade done in your caravan or camper trailer, get in contact with us today and book it in.